Hi and welcome to Cheeky Richo's Pork and Shrimp Dumplings. Just been in a local supermarket and I was astounded at the price of these things. You can make them at home very easily and very quickly and for a much better price and they taste great. We're going to be using the Thermo Chef but you could use a blender. The ingredients are in the recipe box below so let's get started. To our Thermo Chef jug we're just going to add our shrimp. We're using peeled and deveined prawns. Have been cooked, you could use fresh if you like. Speed 6 for 10 seconds and this is what you should have. It's well and truly pulverised now and we're going to add our spring onions that have just been roughly chopped and give them another quick blitz and that's what you should have now now we're going to add our fresh lean pork mince our sesame oil soy sauce and hoisin sauce now just speed one with the measuring cup removed and we're going to drizzle our water into the center until it's well combined Okay, after one minute and 30 seconds, this is what you should have. It's really quite a very soft mix. It's well combined. It smells pretty good. And now we're just going to pop that into our gouji wrappers, or you could use wonton wrappers, and boil them. Now just tip your prawn mixture into a bowl. It'll be a lot easier to do that than contend with the blades. See how really quite soft it is? Still got plenty of texture. It hasn't beaten that spring onion into oblivion. A gouji wrapper, take a teaspoon of our mixture, put it in the centre, squeeze it up in the middle, squeeze it really firmly. And put it aside. We've got our water boiling at the moment. A teaspoon of our mixture into the middle of our gouji wrapper, fold it in half and squeeze it. And then we want to really force that mixture into the centre and squeeze it really, really quite firmly. And that's what you should have. And there we have quite a respectable number of our little dumplings here. Our water is boiling at the moment and we still have this much mixture left over so I'm going to freeze that and use that in a different recipe. Okay, to our boiling water, without overcrowding our pan, we're just going to drop our little dumplings in. I have to cook these in a couple of batches because it will be too many for one batch. Just give them a little stir around to make sure that they're not stuck to the bottom or to each other. And we're just going to pop the lid on again and cook them for about three minutes. After three minutes we take the lid off, give them another stir. They should be floating at stage and just cook them with the lid off for another four minutes. It's time to remove our little dumplings. So just using a slotted spoon, a spoon, just lift them out, drain all the moisture off them. Allow them to cool slightly before you serve them because they are piping hot and put the next batch on. We're serving these with just a simple soy sauce. You could use any dipping sauce that you like. We'll just pop the others in now. Maintain that high heat. Do around so they don't stick and pop the lid on. If you would like to see more interesting recipes and ideas, just check out our Cheeky Richo channel and don't forget to please subscribe and do come back and visit us again soon. We have so much more to show you. Have a little taste, shall we? I'm pretty warm. Cheeky Richo's pork and shrimp dumplings. What's it look like inside? Oh, wow, that's great. Thanks for watching. Mm.